have something I want to talk about. I'm trying to reveal my true personality uh, on this podcast, and I think it's come out over the time I occasionally make jokes, and people probably think, well, that's not real. Conan's exaggerating that for comedic effect or he's being self-deprecating. But I think over the years, whether on TV or here on the podcast, I've talked about how I have no body awareness. Mm. You know, I'm not in touch with my body. Um, very New England, Catholic, Irish. You've noticed that over the years, right? What do you mean you're not in touch? Like you don't know how big you like how big you are? What? Or you're just not in touch with it? Like you don't t- touch yourself? <laughs> okay, well, this got derailed instantly. I'm sorry. I was what just I'm saying to is figure out what you meant that you're not in touch with yeah, your I'm not body. Clear either. Yeah. Okay, uh, I make jokes over the years about how I I don't you know um, I, I'm not someone that's nude a lot. Do you know oh, what I mean? I'm not I one of those people. Okay. I, I don't have a lot of body consciousness. <clears throat> right. I see. Do you say, is, yeah. Was that not clear? Now I get it. You okay. Made it clear. But I do. I touch myself constantly. Okay. But uh, oh, God. But I. But I wear. I'm blindfolded. So I. Oh. I'm. I'm constantly uh, using my hands to try and find out what's going on <laughs> down there. But I do it with my eyes closed and blindfolded. But anyway, my point is. That I, I say that, and I think people probably take it with a grain of salt, meaning, oh, he's just, he's playing up that role. Sure. I had an experience recently that drove home for me just how out of touch I am with my own body, which is uh, I, I've been running a lot in the last year. I, th- I started doing it during COVID. I was running a lot, running a lot, running a lot, and then my left foot really started to hurt. Mm. And I went in to get it checked out, and they said, you have very common plantar fasciitis uh, you know your arch, the 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 tissue there is is really activated, and it's it it. And I'm sure that's quite common with runners and with a lot of people who are on their feet a lot. This doctor recommended. He said, "Go see this woman. I won't say her name. I want to respect her privacy." But she's great. She's this woman is great, and she specializes in in feet. So I went to see this woman, and uh, she's terrific. Uh, she's originally from Scotland. She's got this amazing mm. Scottish accent. And she's really funny and a great storyteller. So she'll be there and she'll, you know, work on my feet and try and fix my arch on my left foot while she's uh, spinning these great tales. And I, she's, she's fantastic. But the first day I went, she said, all right, let's take a look. I don't do a Scottish accent, but she's like, you know, <laughs> ah, ah, you know. <laughs> ah, let's, ah, let's see your foot. And so... Uh, groundskeeper Willie. Yeah, she's sort of a grand. She sounds like Shrek or Groundskeeper <laughs> Willie. And so I take off my shoes, and she's like, "Oh, let's be seeing what you're having here." You know, hundred oh, percent from Ireland. Yeah, Just never set foot in Scotland. Yeah. <laughs> when I said she's Scotch, she enjoys Scotch, but she's okay. Right. She's Irish. Yeah. Uh, no. So anyway, she takes. I take off my uh, my my shoe, and she's looking at my foot, and she goes, "Oh man, look at your foot." And I looked down at my foot and I realized I have never spent any time in my life looking at my own foot. Oh. Really? Never, ever, ever. And I'm, here's, I'm not exaggerating. So I, had, I took off both shoes and I'm looking down at my feet and she was commenting on, she said, your feet are, they're not that malleable. They're like me, they're kind of uptight and they need to be stretched and my she said your toes are all crammed together there's no space between them oh. and i'm seeing it all for the first time <laughs> and this is a part of my body and i'm seeing it and i'm she might as well have been showing me like a quartz crystal that she found in a mountain like i was just like wow look at that it's my fucking feet yeah, without any kidding. socks on them and i'm looking at them as if it's a new mystery and then she goes oh and I'm not looking at my foot at this point. She goes, oh, and you've got a web t- webbed toes. On <gasps> two of my toes are attached with webbing. And I said, which foot? And she was like, because I knew, but I didn't know which foot. What? Holy and shit. she was like, what? She was like, your left foot. And I looked, and sure enough, like my, uh, I think it's my third and fourth toes of like a webbing that goes up high. There's my toes are super long. What? Um, my brother has that. Yeah, and she goes, oh, and she says like that's a you know what they used to think that was a sign of royalty or something, some bullshit someone made up who was stuck with a webbed toe. <laughs> I should mention my brother is Aquaman. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> your brother Aquaman yeah. has. So anyway, I didn't immediately know. I was like looking up at the ceiling when she said you've got a webbed toe, and I know that kind of. But I couldn't tell you which foot. Wow. 
Oh. Now you'd think, am I wrong? That feels that's weird. Very yeah. screwed that's, up that to me. That is really weird. What about I, you're clipping your toenails? You're not ever like who look? clips their toenails? <laughs> oh, <geez. laughs> that's the second. Th- the second thing she said was she she was like Christ. <laughs> I can't do it, Captain. Yes. It's like Freddy Krueger down here. You look here. like Freddy Krueger down here. Because I've let them grow like Howard Hughes. They've been growing <laughs> no. since 1963. Oh, who let They're Wolverine yellow. down here? Oh, you got me a little Wolverine down here. <laughs> You're fucking... Wow. No, no, I, no, no, no. No, I do, but I don't really... I'm not... What I'm saying is... Wow. Why? I'm not... I'm just not in touch with my own... Body, and I realize that the, my least favorite question is if I go to a doctor or I'm seeing anyone about a sore back or anything, and they tell you, okay, how does this feel? Now, how does this feel? I don't like it because oh. I say, I don't know. I don't know how things feel. Oh what do you mean, God. how do things feel? Why are and you like this? I, well, <laughs> I think you could get an answer from uh, uh, parents. Oh. But I don't think there's, I, I think. Uh, you know, I think you need to go home, take off every stitch of clothing, stand in front of a full length mirror, and get to know Conzi. Can you do that? <laughs> can you literally? Can you? Can you no. actually do that? No, because I'm telling you, and I'm not even kidding. If I stood naked in front of a full length mirror to get to know m- my own body, I would be doing bits within yeah. a second. Yeah. I would be doing bits yeah. and takes. I would not. I would not be able to be real. I'm telling you, and this is me being completely honest. But who doesn't know at my age exactly which two toes are wet? That's yeah, crazy. that is a little strange. That's weird. Like, and, yeah. if you had a birthmark on your back, you would you be able to know at least that? Well, I there, would, would I be able to see it or whatever? I mean, like, you know, would you have known that? Oh, or would yeah. a lover have to tell me? Oh. You know you have no. a 666 on your scalp, right? Oh, Jesus. I'm quite aware of that. <laughs> okay. Because he comes by every now and then and says, <laughs> remember the contract. A talk show from Total Obscurity. <laughs> Was your request, and I came through on it. <laughs> then you come back and what a successful podcast, <laughs> and I agreed to that. But you will pay in the next life. Anyway, um, that's Lauren Michaels, by the way. Uh, <laughs> um, you asked I'm, for I'm a blown podcast. away that you don't know your own feet. I didn't know my own feet, and you now she said in uh, this 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 person who works on feet, this uh, this this Scottish woman who's fantastic. She said a lot of people don't know their feet because we just, she said, no one cares about their feet until their feet hurt. And um, resignation? Oh. (laughs) I thought you were resigning and it just said rap question mark. But they would still know which toes are are webbed. That's, you don't have to spend a lot of time I know, but this is one of those things is that I don't think I have any awareness about my body. And I don't like it when people want me to describe where's the pain or how does the pain feel because I think I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what feels better, this or that. They're just trying to help you. Yeah. I know, but I it's, it's my least. I told my wife that. I said my least favorite question is how does this feel? I'm like, I don't know how things feel. <laughs> Let's just get through this Jeez. and get to the grave. <laughs> <laughs> There's so much to unpack. Do you, when you're sleeping, don't you ever kind of wiggle your toes and then you know that two are moving with each other on one foot? And no, there's, the other? there's, I, no. The, first of all, you can't feel. There's nothing. The, the web toes don't feel but any different. you can different. feel one pulling the other. No, I'm they sure. don't articulate. My toes don't really even articulate. What, you just have no jointed toes? No, they, they they should articulate. I have all the equipment down there. Trust me, I've got all the equipment. Oh. He's doing it again. No, no, no. That's not a sexual thing. I just mean my. I was talking in a sexual way about my toes. Okay. Huh. But but what I'm saying is that uh, I don't know. Um, I couldn't like grasp something with my toes. Do you know what I mean? Can you do that? Could you grasp I mean, something yeah, with your toes? Yeah, but not like an ape, but yeah, I could. Well, I you're could pick, somewhat ape-like. I guess. You're a very intelligent, fussy ape. I can pick up a re- TV remote control with my feet. I mean, I don't... Yeah. I'm, yeah. I'm not. You can type with your feet and play the piano with your feet, but you're not like an ape. No. You do beautiful scrimshaw with your feet. You make origami with your feet, but you're not an ape. Well, I'll take that over this guy that doesn't even know he has feet. Yeah. I don't know I have feet. Are I'm... you comfortable with your body? Like if you went to a nude beach and everybody no! was getting naked, you'd be not. like, let's do this, guys. Of course I'm not But you, I, you were in a bit once with Chelsea Handler where you were 
like not naked, but you had a, yeah, a, a yeah. you know, a nude. Yeah, but I don't. That's not my preference. That's when you do a bit with Chelsea Handler. It's understood you must be naked. Oh. But and I will do anything for comedy. <laughs> but it's not my preference to be naked. Oh. Uh, it's not my natural state, even though it is my yeah, right, natural literally. state. I yeah. love it. Yeah. Um, uh, when we go to the Korean spa, I'm like, let's do this. My mother said I was born in a little three piece suit. Oh, jeez. Oh, yeah. yeah. No. And maybe this is too personal, but what do you sleep in? Like boxer briefs and a t-shirt. Okay. And then long socks. <laughs> Go. And a Nixon mask. <laughs> 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 And when I wake up, I go, it's going to be a great day. 